I've got no time for things like that. Yeah, he really said that. He simply needs to practice more. You listen to the wrong people. That was no big deal. Is it really true? And there's more, believe me. <laughs> I agree with you completely. He thinks it's as easy as that. <laughs> you hardly know who to believe these days. That will never change. If he doesn't see that, I can't help him. Tell me that isn't true. Hey! Any news of Bennett? They seem to have taken him to the barracks and tossed him into the dungeon. How can we get him out of there? I don't have any ideas so far. I can't get to his cell to talk to him. All I can do is keep my ears open, but there isn't much to learn around here. Any news? You could say so. The Paladins have arrested Bennett, our Smith. So I've heard. That's a bad business. You can say that again. You listen to the wrong people. He should have known better. There's nothing you can do about it. Hey! Show me your maps. It's a bad business. I knew this piece would interest you. What piece would that be? Well, that old map you just bought. I know your kind. You go for any chance of finding riches. Why don't you keep it for yourself? I'm an old man, and the times when I set out myself are long past. I leave that to younger people. What kind of a map is it? It seems to be a treasure map or the like. But you look to me like one who'll get to the heart of this matter himself. Where did you get this map? Oh, I found that in a stack of old maps which I bought recently. The seller must have overlooked it. He should have known that. Come back again later. I I'm sure to have something new for you then. Better to watch out when you tell one. Is it really true? Some problems solve themselves. I've got some honey tobacco for you. It is a great pleasure doing business with you. Can you make me a prophecy? Yes. Time has progressed. And I shall give you a prophecy in return for a few coins. How much? For a paltry 250 coins. I shall risk a glance through time for you. Tell me about the future. All right, son of knowledge. I shall now enter a state of trance. Are you ready? Who shall force what is nobody's destiny but yours through fire and snow, through ice and flames, men in foreign armor, a swamp. Lizards, they await you. That's all. There's nothing more I can see. Hear ye, inhabitants of Corinus. By the explicit order of the Honorable Lord Hagen, the following... How's it going? You don't look like you care about other people's worries in the least. Yeah, sure I do. What do you know? The world is full of surprises. I cleared out some of my stuff recently and sold a stack of old maps to Brahim, the cartographer down by the harbor. Unfortunately, I noticed that I'm missing a document. I assume it must have slipped in among the papers. Could you perhaps get it back for me? I'll see what I can do. You're so sweet. I wish you much luck. If you bring back the paper to me, I'll give you a reward. 
Did you mean this document? Yes, that's exactly it. Thank you. What's my reward? Not so fast. Here's your money. Hey, you! So where are you hiding your loot? Come on, you didn't really think I would tell you that. You'll have enough opportunity to get your hands on some loot of your own. Remember, those who are too greedy end up with nothing. Can you teach me? Sure, no problem. Just let me know when you're ready. Show me how to pick pockets. If you want to empty somebody's pockets, distract him. Just start talking to him. While you're talking to him, size him up. Look out for bulging pockets, jewelry, or leather straps around the neck. And most of all, note how keen the fellow seems. Robbing a drunk day laborer is not the same as stealing from a watchful merchant. If you're too clumsy, of course, he'll smell a rat. So above all, keep your cool. Hey, you. I want to become more dexterous. Hey! What's behind that locked door? Behind that is the chest. The chest of the master lock picker. Fingers. He put such an unbelievably complicated lock on it that, till now, no one has been able to open it. Unfortunately, he got nabbed. They tossed him through the barrier, where he probably died. But if you want to try opening the chest, here's the key to the room. been condemned in the name of Innos. The sentence is death by hanging. The execution will take place in a few days. Have you got a job for me? Hmm, there is a thing I'd like to have, but I haven't found one so far. What can I get you? A sextant. Bring me a sextant. I'll pay you a good price for it. I've got a sextant for you. Incredible. You actually managed to find one. Here, you've really earned your pay. Hey. 
Okay. I managed to open the chest. That's impossible. It looks like we've got a new master lock picker. Congratulations on this accomplishment. Hear ye, inhabitants Can you of make Kermit's me an awesome oh, only when will that order when of the Honorable Lord Hagen, the following decree is hereby hey. enacted. The mercenary Smith Bennett, who hey. treacherously murdered the paladin Lothar, has been condemned in the name of Innos. The sentence is death by hanging. The execution will take place in a few days. What about Bennett, the blacksmith? You mean the mercenary? He is sitting in jail where he belongs. Can I talk to him? Certainly. Just go in. But if you try to help him escape, you will be in for it. I've been able to rescue some of the missing people. How many people did you find? All those who were still alive. All? I, uh, that was a grand deed. How's the situation in town? Everything is under control. What do you want here? I want to see the prisoners. Yeah, go ahead and say goodbye to your pal. You haven't come to get your buddy out of here, have you? Forget it. As soon as I raise the alarm, the boys will be here in an instant. And then, we'll have a cement mercenary. <laughs> How come you're in the slammer? Those swine have thrown me in the hole. I'm supposed to have murdered a paladin. But I didn't do it. They're only trying to frame me. Why would they do that? How would I know? You've got to get me out of here. Talk to Lord Hagen. Tear down the wall. Who cares? Just do something. What happened? I went downtown with Hodges to buy some supplies for our boys. Suddenly we heard a loud scream and the sound of running feet. Get to the point. We knew at once that something had happened, and that they would grab us at once if they saw us there. We ran like hell, then just before we got to the city gate, I tripped and sprained my ankle. The rest is soon told. The militia was on me at once, and they threw me straight into this hole. Who was murdered? I have no idea. One of the paladins. I don't know them. Have you got a name? Some Lothar, I think. Well, I don't know. I'm not really sure. You had better ask Lord Hagen. He knows all the details. Do they have any evidence against you? They say they have a witness who recognized me. Well, do you know who the witness is? No, all I know is that he's lying. Who's leading the investigation? Lord Hagen himself. Since the victim was one of the paladins, this falls under martial law. What does that mean? That's easy to guess. If I don't get out of here, they're going to let me swing without further ado. You've got to help me or there'll be a war. Lee's not going to take this lying down. You can figure out for yourself what that means. Hear ye, inhabitants of Corinus, by the explicit order of... Everything all right with you? I know what you're planning, but you won't succeed in getting away with the prisoner. Hey, you! Hey, you! What are you doing here? I'm training the boys to use a crossbow and help them become a little more dexterous.
Show me your They never should have let it get so far. Something had to happen one of these days. People like you will get nothing from me. Why? First you stir up the farmers, and then you act like nothing happened. Now beat it. You're driving away my customers. I'll never get this open without the right key. And thus spake Adonis to his brothers, Never again shall you walk upon hey, my you. land, for it is sacred. And so shall it be. But the human and the beast waged war upon the land of Adonis. Are you still working for the paladins? I finished the commission from Lord Hagen. Now I'm making magic ore blades for him. But for pay this time. But I also have the time again to make a few weapons on the side for the merchants in the marketplace. So, if you're looking for a good blade, you should try them. Hey, you! Hey, you! Thanks for saving me. It was very noble of you to pay for me. I want to show you my gratitude. Here's a bottle of wine which my husband, may Innos rest his soul, brought back from the Southern Islands. Also, I'm going to spread the news around. At last there's somebody in town whose virtue... Yeah, yeah, never mind. Thanks, man. I mean, thank you, really. And there I was, thinking I'd never get out of here. What are you doing here? I got locked in. The door was open, and all I wanted to do was have a little look-see. But as soon as I was inside, the guard came and locked the damn door. This is, uh, somewhat embarrassing. <laughs> I'd be very grateful if it could just remain between you and me. I understand that wasn't exactly something to be proud of. <laughs> I think I need a drink now. How's it going? How much do you want? What do you mean, how much? I'm the money lender and you came to me. What could you want from me? Money, of course. Some miserable pickpocket has stolen my ledger. You didn't have anything to do with this business, did you? Me? No. Yes, yes, all right. Just get out of here. What do you know? We have mutual friends. In that case, let me express my gratitude for being rescued. Here, take these lockpicks. 
I'm sure you'll find them useful. You already know what I think. Hey, you. And how's it going now? Monty is back. He's busy studying the plans. Maybe we can get the ship done now. Give me something to drink. Look for someone else. There's enough people running around. Some problems solve themselves. I already thought as much. I hardly know what to believe anymore. What are you standing around this? Nobody ever asked. Uh, he really should have known better. Hey, you. Talk to Bromar if you want. Hey, I can't take care of you now. Nobody wants to know. Why get so worked up? Why did you pick that up? These are bad times. Hey, you. Hey, if you want to buy fish. For all your stuff, I... 400. All right, so... We've made some good... I don't know why he gets so worked up. I'm not touching that. What do you have to offer? Then pay attention. Do the work. That's terrible. That's what I've always said. If I hadn't seen it with my own eyes, he simply talks too much. Really? How interesting. My task is, but who? He simply talks too much. Show me your wares.
Instruct what? Hey. So why won't they listen to me? That's all just gossip. They listen to me. But no, he insisted he knew better. There you are. Again. That's been known a long time. Nobody ever asked for my opinion. That's been known a long time. Hey, you! Someone's gotta pay for that. Nobody wants to know. I agree with you completely. How's it going? You'd better scram, you filthy mercenary, before I call the guards. Relax. I'm not here to steal from you. I'm looking for work. Ah, so you want to work for me? Hmm. That is, of course, a different matter. There is, alas, one minor problem. I don't know whether I can trust you. You'll have to prove your loyalty first. Put me to the test. Hmm. All right. Listen. Bring me the sacred hammer of the Magicians of Fire. They keep it somewhere in the basement of their monastery. If you pull that off, I might think about hiring you as a bodyguard. All right. Fine. But remember, if they catch you, I've never heard of you. I've heard you are with the Paladins in the Valley of Mines. I'm impressed. You should take your time and browse my goods. Right now, I have a very special potion to offer. Show me your wares.
Yeah, See? get away that from here. That wasn't so hard. What do you want here? Go! See? That wasn't so hard. See? That wasn't so hard. Do you really believe that? I've got my own opinion about that. You don't have to talk. It's a bad business. No idea. You tell me. In hey, you! I am Geryon, master of two-handed combat and paladin of the king. Why are you disturbing me? The situation in the Valley of Mines is quite worrying, but we shall develop plans to get rid of the dangers and get our boys out of there along with the ore. I need to talk to you about Bennett, but that's the mercenary who murdered one of my men. I believe that Bennett is innocent. The evidence is clear. He is guilty. So what if the proof is wrong? Be careful what you say. You raise some serious accusations. If you cannot present me with evidence that the witness lied, then you had best hold your tongue. How come you're so sure that Bennett is the killer? We have a witness. As you can see, there is no doubt about the mercenary's guilt. Who is that witness? Cornelius, the governor's secretary, saw the murder. His description fits Bennett, no doubt about that. As far as I am concerned, that settles the matter. The mercenary will hang for treason. Hey, you! You saw the murder of Lothar, didn't you? I need not answer any questions about a current investigation. Lord Hagen already has everything I know on record. What was it you saw? Really, I haven't got any time now. You need to go now. The office is closing. Enough of that. What did you see? I... I saw how the mercenary struck down the paladin from behind. And then he took his sword and rammed it through his chest. Are you completely sure? Yes, of course. I saw it with my own eyes, but I really haven't got any time now. There's a huge pile of paperwork I need to do. I don't believe you. So what? What are you going to do about it? I could tell the mercenaries where you live. What is that supposed to mean? I bet they're dying to make your acquaintance. 
They're not very happy at all. You can't do that. They would kill me. That is very possible. I'll say whatever you want, but you mustn't do that. So what really happened? I didn't see what happened. I received some gold for blaming that mercenary. In times like these, it's everyone for himself. I needed that money. Who paid you? That's enough. He'll kill me if I rat him out. Are you going to tell that to Lord Hagen too? I'm not a lunatic. I can't stay in town now. Cornelius lied. How did you know that? Here, I've got his diary. Everything's in there. That slimy little criminal! In view of the new evidence, there is nothing else I can do. By virtue of the office granted me by king and church, I declare that the prisoner Bennett is exonerated of all charges and is thereby a free man. Cornelius is to be taken into immediate custody for perjury. He's made himself scarce. Sooner or later he will turn up, then we shall arrest him. I have done differently. I used to say that myself. better off myself. Just like you said. I've got Lamar's ledger right here. Where did you get that? That shouldn't interest you so much as the fact that your name is in it. Give it to me. What will you give me then? I have no money to spare and can give you nothing but my heartfelt gratitude. Can you say if I might undo the work of Beliar. And Beliar spoke to another creature. Look what I have here. Hmm? But this is Lamar's ledger. Oh, what are you planning to do with that? Here's the book. Oh, thanks. I mean, you saved my butt. Lamar can get rather ugly. Here, take this as a reward. It's the very last drop. Show me a... What book I have here? Lamar's ledger. How did you get hold of that? Well... If Lamar doesn't have it anymore, that's a good thing. But I'd rather have it myself. Here, take the book. Thanks. Take this as a reward. What is this you've given me? It is a key to the gate of wealth. Hear ye, inhabitants of Corinus, by the explicit order of the Honorable Lord Hagen, the following decree is hereby enacted. The Smith Bennett has been declared free of guilt because his innocence was proven by a clever advisor of Lord Hagen. 
Everybody knows by now. Someone's got to do the work. Show me a... Now that's typical, isn't it? If I hadn't seen it with my own eyes... That's what I've always said. Show me your way. Take I your pick. Take care of everything for everybody. If I hadn't seen it with my own eyes... I've got a suit. Honestly, I witnessed it myself. But that's terrible. Show me. That's not what my husband thinks. Don't tell this to anyone. Honestly, I witnessed it myself. I won't tell her a thing from now on. Really, how interesting. seen it with my own eyes. He can't keep anything to himself. He simply talks hey, you! So, back to working in the fields? Hey, the guy who saved my life. Yeah, it's more hard labor for me now. Especially with those two nutty brothers. Oh man, the bandits weren't that bad. Hey. So, back to working in the fields. Hey, the guy who saved my life. Yeah, it's more hard labor for me now, especially with those two Hey. Everything still fine with you? We can manage. I just wonder how much longer we're gonna have to endure these devils in black. I can't stand it anymore. They sneak around the house making those funny noises. About your farmhands, you brought them back. You're one brave man. Take this gold as a token of my gratitude. Is there any other news? Someone keeps stealing my sheep lately. I haven't been able to sleep properly for nights. Who could have done that? I've got a hunch about that. Some really nasty fellows have settled into the caves over in the forest. I find it hard to believe that they're living on berries. I'm almost certain that's where my sheep are disappearing to. Did anything else happen? My sheep keep disappearing. Soon I won't.
Hey, you bum. You haven't come about that sheep, have you? You stole the sheep from Akil the farmer. So what? What are you gonna do about it? Give me that sheep or I'll punch you in the eye. Then look out, boy. All hell's about to break loose. I found the sheep rustlers. You were right. Those fellows in the forest cave did it. They'll never steal sheep from you again. Thanks. You sure are a strange mercenary. Not at all like the others I know. Take this as a small token of thanks for the selfless favor you did for me. Very good. Here's a few gold coins. I hope it's enough. <laughs> 